Hello everyone, so I kind of want to share with you all what's going on with me. Yes, I do have mood disorder and I just recently figured that out. I was prescribed with medication. So this video, I don't want to like tell too much about what's going on. Actually, previous video in Cantonese about what's really happening with my life. But this video, I want to focus on how I deal with it. So first of all, stick with your medication. I was prescribed with an antidepressant and also anti-anxiety. And what happened is I just stopped them just because of the side effect. I have trouble sleeping, eating, and I I found myself so pale so I just stopped it which I shouldn't and I have a withdrawal symptom it's kind of boosts my suicidal ideation and I end up cutting and be hospitalized like you can still see the mark and it was terrible I never want to hurt myself I would say the medication actually can you know your neurotransmitter just get messed up stuff happen so first of all don't get off your meds see the doctor don't do random stuff and secondly I've been to counseling I also did something called EMDR um, which is eye movement desensitization and reprocessing so it helps me to recall like past trauma and explain about my further life decisions because like when we're so young stuff happened to us we remember the feeling but we kind of put into words so there are like unsolved crises which might hinder us from like our growth or like some probably concepts in mind so that actually really helped me it's just like I have to like close my eyes and then allow the flashback to come back and the therapist is using like the finger like moving and to stimulate my eye movement so like my brain is like working better like processing recalling past memory I also keep a journal write about what happened my mood and then my random flashback my dreams to figure out what is going on in me because I am a person that is really emotionally retarded I don't understand what I'm feeling I only feel happy or unhappy so that's how I figure out I need to sit down face my emotional like directly I don't want to escape from it anymore write down figure out what's the problem face the problem and because of the medication I have really short attention span and my memory is not good so I always carry a notepad with me write down stuff I need to do and so I won't forget easily and ended up hating myself even more be actually selective to people that you trust like talk to them don't be afraid to go out for sometimes socializing can help your improve your mood even though some people they cannot handle those emotional stress when we open up to them but there's always some people it's out there probably you just don't know because it surprised me how many people actually gone through these stuff and willing to open up with me and like check with me whether I'm doing good or not but at the same time some people I expect them to be there they're not there sadly not many people understand and even those they understand they might not accept it even if they accept it they may not even know how or what to say just to comfort you or help you because these are really sensitive topics that we don't we even want to touch on and your negative energy can actually pass on to them they might actually don't want it but it's okay because you don't need to search for love from or attention from the others because you don't really need that to survive right i hope everyone is doing well so this is like my short sharing i'll see you all later bye and remember to enjoy your life and have fun